Good morning, Noah. Hi, Natalie. Good morning. How are you? I'm doing great. Thank you for asking. Yeah, I mean, hey, there's nothing better to do than watch TV and chill and quarantine, right? Uh huh. You know, <laughs> that's what we're all doing. Oh, my goodness. Hey, by the way, Natalie, did you watch that Disney family sing along last night on the ABC? I didn't know it. Do you know that I actually don't own a TV? You, you, you said what now? You don't own a TV? I'm a very naughty actress. I oh can barely gosh. figure out how to watch my own show. What do you do in life then if you don't have a TV? Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. I'm stretching. I'm playing with my cats. I'm playing uh -huh. my chimes. Uh -huh. Look, sometimes when you work in TV and you spend 14 hours a day filming a show, mm -hmm. it's nice to take a bit of a break, but I yeah. hear there are some great shows on that I need to catch up on. That's Although true. I'm already watching my favorite, Baker and the Beauty. That's, that's going to that's gonna keep me going for nine weeks. You know what, Natalie? I have cats, too. I have three cats that are so, yeah. A man after my own heart. Mm -hmm. They are lovely. They snuggle up with me. They snuggled up with me until I started singing last night. Then, then they ran. They were like, oh, no, what, what happened? You're, anyway. so, you're so lucky that they cuddle. Mine just <laughs> run away. They're, they're, they're uh -huh. not very affectionate, but I'm their slave, so what can you do? Uh -huh. Well, see, I give them goldfish. I'm not supposed to do that, but see, they like goldfish. So I'm like, okay, okay. C c come over here. See, look, now I'm going to get my cats taken away. They're going to take them away. But anyway, <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, well, let's go ahead and jump into what we're really here for, which, like you said, The Baker and the Beauty. It is already really becoming one of the hottest new shows on cable TV. So what's been the feedback so far for you that you've gotten since the show has debuted? Oh, it's just been overwhelmingly and unanimously positive, which is oh. so nice to be on a show that is resonating in people's hearts. Mm -hmm. And of course, we could never have imagined or predicted that we would be in this quarantine um, while the show came out. And of course, it's not an ideal situation for anybody. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, I think it's, re it's a really beautiful show that is not just heartwarming, but uplifting and funny and yeah. and real and beautiful and and what what it has been like um doing to people in terms of like people have been writing me like oh this is just what I needed it's taken my mind off everything it's made me hopeful again it's made me connect with my family it's made me believe in love I don't want to oh. say we're saving the world but <laughs> but it's a pretty beautiful show um to be tuning into right now especially when all the other messages out there are pretty heavy and dense this is like yeah. something that will leave you feeling really uplifted and and hopefully in stitches laughing because it's hilarious mm -hmm. as well yeah oh well that's great that that's wonderful you know what and I'm a talker, so everywhere I go, Natalie, in the world, I talk people to death. They're like, oh, gosh, here comes motor mouth. But anyway, Natalie, what I wanted to tell you was is something about the Baker and the Beauty. I um, I have to go get allergy shots on a weekly basis. Anyway, that's totally off point. But the, the, the point that I was going to try to tell you was is um, I'm friends with the nurses at my uh, ENT, my ear, nose, and throat doctor, and they were telling me, because I was telling them I was going to inter interview you, she likes the Baker and the Beauty, and she was saying during these rough times, she turns to this show to watch you guys because you guys give her hope and you guys give her love, and I just wanted to share that with you because I think that's so great that a show like this can do something like, you know, during these rough times that we're all living in. Oh, that makes me so happy to yeah. hear, you know. We felt like when we were making it, we felt like, no, this is really special. We're really channeling some beautiful energies and emotions into this project. And the fact that now that it's airing, people are like really, uh, they're, they're feeling that as well. And we're getting to spread some of that love and, and, and goodness. Oh, there's nothing better. There's no better feeling. So thank you. And hello to, to the nurse. Yeah. I love it. It, it, it's, it, it. It's a little mood booster. Don't drink your coffee. Just watch The Baker and the Beauty. That's right. <laughs> uh, thank you. That's such a yeah. nice compliment. Thanks, Noah. Now, you know, of course, the first episode aired last Monday. The second episode is going to be airing this coming out week. But what are some of the things that we should look out for, Natalie, from your character, Noah? Uh, almost like my name, but it, it doesn't have the H on the end. I'm like, oh, look at that. I there. know. Yeah, and it's, it's so you... funny, too, because my sister name is Danielle. And look, Daniel. Oh, look, uh-huh, yeah, all right, well, anyway. Wow. <laughs>
We got two Noahs up in here. Which Noah will uh, win? I just want to add that um, actually the pilot is being rebroadcast Saturday night, 10 p.m. on ABC oh. for those who missed mm -hmm. episode one and want to catch it so they can um, get up to speed for episode two on Monday. So um, episode one, obviously they meet and sparks fly. Mm -hmm. And then episode two, she invites him to her birthday party. And uh, and I love episode two. It's very dear to my heart because um, very quickly into the show, the the kind of veil is lifted off mm -hmm. Noah as a celebrity, and you get to see, you get to glimpse into the real, the reality and the sadness behind behind that that smiling exterior. Um, oh. And at the same time, it's not all sad. You get to see Daniel be his charming self and mm -hmm. really like really start to woo her and romance her and, and, and watch her and watch her kind of surrender to that, which is really interesting. And, and that's all just a backstory for the hilarious family mm -hmm. who are, um, who, I mean, they're just the most amazing uh, cast and they're yeah. so funny. And so they're kind of dealing with like, wow, our, our Daniel is dating this like famous guy. And like, uh -huh. It's uh -huh. very funny. It's very funny yeah. to see them kind of deal with this major life change. I think it's a great storyline, definitely. Now, before we have to wrap this up here, because they're like, come on, let's wrap it up. You know. <laughs> uh, lastly, I want to ask you, you know, how is, uh, how is it like working with your co-star, Victor, you know, as he plays, you know, Daniel in The Baker and the Beauty? But how is it like to work with him on set? What was it like, you know, meeting him for the first time when you guys walked on set, you know, to get ready to start shooting these episodes? Well, I actually met him at the, in, during the audition process. Oh, really? And uh, I kind of like threw him a joke and it uh, uh, uh. went right over his head because he was like stuck in his lines. And that's kind of just like a real example of how the whole season was. Me trying to like crack him up and him stuck in his lines. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, uh, um, uh. Victor is a very, very lovely man and human and a very committed actor. And he would say yes to all the crazy acting exercises I would have him do with me. Some of them included staring in my eyes with no words for minutes on end. Or other times I'd make him dance salsa with me before our scenes to kind of like get that chemistry going. Yeah. Um, and he never said no to any of my crazy requests. And I give him <laughs> that. Um, at the same time, I also like to describe our chemistry as oil and water. <laughs> So oh, different. oil and water, and Natalie. Okay, now but, hold on, wait. This is done turned into a different uh, interview here. Okay, oil and water. When, but what happens when oil and water meet? Sizzle. Oh. So hmm. that's what you're seeing. Okay, Natalie. <laughs> Natalie. Okay, girl. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> Oh, Natalie, you're so much fun. I, I I really like you a lot. You are just adorable, and I I I love this show. And I think that if, if if people aren't watching, then where are you? Do you not have a TV like Natalie? <laughs> where are you? Come on, people. Catch up, everyone. Catch up. Catch up to speed. Natalie, this has been a lot of fun. Thank you for taking the time to speak with me. The Baker and the Beauty it continues on Monday, April the 20th at 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on ABC. You have a great weekend and stay well and stay safe. And hopefully we can all get out of quarantine uh, sooner than later. Thanks, Noah. So good right. speaking to you. Take care.